next week, I sent out a letter saying that the requirements, <coughs> the proposed requirements for the that we're going to not include college courses. And if you have concerns or questions, contact me or come to the next the first second meeting. Yes, that's correct. And that was, that, that was the other point that I was going to say. As devil advocate, if you have three or four students that have been taking college courses under the assumption that they were necessary to be out of the time. And, and Rosemary is one of them. She's but, got a son who's there, but so, she still feels it's fair, so fair for everybody. In, in, in order to get the full discussion, we sent out a letter. If you have concerns, if you have things, please come and see us. We'll make sure that the three or four that, that we know that have been doing it, make sure they get the letter, and they can either come share with me or come share in July with us. And, and let me just share with you that uh, I've had one student who's now a senior. Uh, asked me that question of, that this was being discussed and I said yes and we discussed at the next meeting and he did share with me that he was of the opinion that change it now. Mm -hmm. but, uh, so. Well before we go any further I'd like to make a motion that we approve uh, revised policy 5127 to evaluate the requirements and that these uh, go into effect immediately. Second. Motion and second. Any further question or comment on this? In regard to the I, I'm still good, but I'm still wanting to investigate more on the magna cum laude. The Latin. Cum laude, that, the Latin, uh, the Latin on. Yes. Because we are creating a system with a cutthroat versus an inclusive system where we say, you know, this class, they're awesome. They have this many, not on the magna cum. I don't know the order. <laughs> I was never there in college. But. Okay, which one's the highest one? So, so. And why are they there? 4.0 or above 4 .0 or something. Or above. Yeah. And imagine if every child that was 4.0 or above had the honor, and so we're including. We want to have the class with the most of well, America. Well, well, we do that. We have uh, honors, high honors, mm -hmm. and, and what's the other thing we're called? This thing is called. But the so question we, yeah. is okay, but, but do we not have a cutthroat system where the kids are watching the grades? And, and dealing with my daughter, this we know what kids will share what kids won't share. What kids will hoard this and not give information. I mean, that, it, it, it's there. So can we just kind of, not today, but if we can just rethink a system where we're promoting our kids and honoring the kids a little bit more than just a little star. You know, all of you guys, just let's include instead of exclude. Yeah, the colleges do, right? The colleges all do that. They do that also. They don't have like a lot of choices they're trying to have. If you have a and we can still calculate our top 20, but we're, we're incorporating more versus a single or two or, in my class we had six valedictorians, and believe you me, it was cutthroat. And I didn't know what cliff notes were, because they were like this, I had no idea until I went to college, I'm like, that's what they were hiding. Because it wasn't a system of, let's help each other, let's get together and study so we can all ace Mr. Martinez's class. Versus, well, well, you know what? Well, you know what? I, uh, <laughs> I, I understand what you're saying, but I'll tell you what, this, 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 not this 08 class, but the 07 class had a lot of students, and, and some of them were from the, uh, who graduated this year, they all got together and had study groups and did that, so they did help each other out. Mm -hmm. Because my son was part of one of those study groups, and so was, and so was the right. class, so they, they did help each other out. No, no, sure, no, one more thing, I'll yeah. discuss. But one thing you mentioned that was kind of interesting, which we found out kind of just getting looking into colleges, the one thing that really is appealing over Josh from MIT is they take the reverse. They and when they for and when they everything is grouped, they don't get graded to pass fail their first semester. They do group work and they say when you get in the real world, you've got to work together as a team. They don't do it at the end of your senior year when you graduate. There's no magna summa summa. It's basically everybody's there to get their diploma. So they don't even do any recognizing up higher and it really helps with the cutthroat, yeah, as far as we're not sharing, we're not working, and um, it's a real nice atmosphere that way. They're real, you know, it's a plus. So. But of course, that's college, but anyway. It's just food for thought and yeah. things that we can continue our discussion with, but after this, as soon as possible, would be great. But just how can we include more kids, give them the phrases? Okay, got a motion and a second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Motion carries. <coughs> after Josh's first year at MIT, they're going to say, how many more can Brawley send us, right? Yeah, we're hoping for one more. <laughs> there you go. Okay, next we have a uh, sexual harassment policy, including 
complaint procedures for all illegal harassment pertaining to child care slash preschool services. When we got our complaint monitoring, uh, CPM did it. They did it our child care and they wanted the sexual um, harassment policy posted in the preschool. And basically, if you notice, the changes that they didn't want specifically just wanted it to say, and parents slash guardians. And parents slash guardians will be notified. So we did what she wanted and now we just on it. So basically, our policy will be switched. So we put a lot of and parents and guardians. We, uh, as part of the Williams uh, Uniform Complaint Procedures that we had, we seen there was a Valenzuela settlement suit on the cases, and that is now a Williams complaint. So on our Williams Complaint Procedures, we did everything except number four on the complaint procedure, said high school lecture exam, intensive instruction and services. So one of the things that somebody can complain about the Williams is that they didn't have the cases, and they were not afforded the opportunity for classes to do it up to two years after the graduate, they get out of high school. So we just had to have to add that section in the report that said that that's part of the building uniform campaign procedure. Okay. So do we have a tracking system? Mm -hmm. Somehow for those kids? Yeah. So we have to give them the opportunity to hear. So there's a way to keep track of it. Oh, move. Motion. 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 All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion carries. Moving on public relations. This is a motion to approve the parent handbook pertaining to child care slash preschool services. Same thing. When the CPM came, we wanted uh, a handbook to be given to every parent that uses our daycare services. So Roy put it together with a handbook that they have already had for all together. And that's going to be handed out to every single parent that, and parent that uses, that has a child in our child care system. How many, how many students are there? How many Approximately. Say, 20. No, I would say between this one and the babies, um, maybe 30 or 30. 30. Okay, more than We have actually 49 kids that participate in the Cal State Board and 16 parents. But that's also, it could be the pandemic. Okay, motion and second. Any further questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Motion carries. Uh, no people, personnel, or personnel items. Moving on to business and finance. This is a discussion of, uh, for motion to approve resolution 080901 for the purpose of providing child care and development services and to authorize the designated personnel to sign contract documents for fiscal 0809. This is a yearly resolution. Okay. Okay, motion and second. Any further question or comments before the roll call? The roll call, please. Noreda? Yes. Garcia? Yes. Brianna? Yes. 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 Yes.